Hi guys, this is 3ds Max Edge Modeling Tutorial. So first thing you should do is to make planes. Rotate it to 90 degree. Same here. So we need now front You can press shift and rotate gonna make duplicate and rotate it to hundred and eighty degree. Okay. Now right click anywhere. Uh, choose object properties and choose back face cup. Now we need blueprint. We can choose this one. Make sure the pictures are exactly the same size. Okay, that should be it. Now just drag and drop the pictures. Then go to modifier list uh, and choose maps color. So it's 70. Now we're gonna need profile pictures.
Okay. And that is the fish part. We can save now. Now how to start? We can start with this front. Pro you can press Alt and W and it will full screen the selected window. So first of all go to here and create plane like this. Convert it to editable poly. You can press Alt and X to uh, make it transparent. If it doesn't work, right click, object properties, and uh, disable by layer. Okay, and how as you can see, it's transparent. Now we can start working. If lines doesn't show up, press F4. And let's start. It's uh, just self-explanatory. Just do as I as I'm doing now, right now. Okay, after you do that, you can press Alt X again, I mean Alt W, and go to side view. You can turn off this, that you can move this over here. Like this. If uh, only one pic uh, one side picture is al aligned, you can always choose the uh, plane itself and move just like this. Until you get gets the close perfect match. Okay. Back to the eye. Now if we should align the side wheel. Okay, now choose this one. Like this. Okay. After you've done that too, you can just choose this one over here, select edge, press shrift, uh, press air, uh, then shrift and increase this size, like this, uh, release it and do it again. Okay, and now we can work with it.
Okay. The best best way to learn this uh, type of modeling is practice. I'm explaining here the basics uh, so we can do it over and over again until you get it right uh, so uh, I'm, I'm gonna tell you just time-lapse the modeling and I'm gonna uh, talk on uh, uh, main points I want to uh, say that uh, will make you the learning process easier so let's resume the increasing the model yeah. Okay, after you are happy with this part, you can just start modeling the nose. Uh, go to the standard primitives and choose plane again. And start with here like this. You can change the segments. And do the same thing with these two. So this is here, so as you can see. And put it right there. Like this. Okay. In this case, you can we can choose this, and we can just uh, choose any tool and press Shift and drag. That's enough. We can just make it smaller. Like this. Okay. 
and now we can just start connecting those so you can uh, connect these two models by going to this here and press collapse and collapse selected if it's editable mesh right click it again convert to editable poly okay now we can work with those two at the same time like this I like to delete this inside the eye pick the vertexes so I'm gonna do that and uh, yeah press delete now we can just choose this and inside edge now press error yeah or W and shrift and drag okay next so this is here this here this here okay now we are missing this line here and here so I'm gonna add that so you can just press here and press shift and click when uh, yellow lines will appear go down here and press connect and it's connected same thing down here do the same thing Okay, now we can work with it. Okay. Now we can uh, weld these vortexes to together, so all we have to do is select both at the same time go down here and press weld and it's welded This is the last one here. Okay, let's see how it looks. Nothing. I would say it's not that bad. You should change some things.
So now it's the tricky part. Uh, the modeling nose and mouth is a little bit uh, harder. Uh, uh, I can show you the easy way to model mouth, uh, but if you want uh, the better quality model, uh, I would suggest to learn the hard way. So let's start modeling. You can just delete the whole thing, this area, from here to here, and model the it uh, independently from the model. And the easy way that I mentioned is to just exclude, uh, to make these things go like this, and make model from these vertexes. But I will try to make the new model of the mouth so again choose the plane
I think that's it uh, of the edge modeling tutorial. Uh, besides these things that I explained, it's just self-explanatory. You should just training hard to get it done right. So do it few times. So for example, maybe four or five times, and you should be good to go. And if you have some questions, comment it down in the comment section. And I will see you in the next video.